Not gearless. Not gearless. Gunless. Let's not get this shit twisted here. Time for gunless. A much less painful challenge. All right, where's the where's the gas mask head? Head. Oh yeah, there we go. Perfect. Man, this is great. Yeah. What the fuck is this shit? Hold on. Get this shit out of here. Blood explosion or melee? Fuck melee. Uh, me uh, I'm gonna go down middle tree until I hit level 31 and do blood explosion. Dying after you kill all the enemies is just always pretty stupid, I'd say. Then again, I don't know what happened. To what the fuck is this shit? Go to DLC and get to level seven. I would do that if uh if 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 the uh fucking oh Tannis has got to talk. If the load times weren't four years. Somebody delivered a feast. Gunless or Flame of Firehawk? Hell yeah. You better believe I'm getting Flame of Firehawk. No, you don't have to pick up the shotgun. I don't have to pick up the shotgun! I can just pick up the- Ah. Oh. Damn. Oh, might be fucked. Uh, you gotta run away, don't you? Alright, so... It's just 100% guaranteed that I die a lot before even getting to Boom Boom, isn't it? Because certain things don't drop before you're past Flint. So BP is all you got? Exactly. BP and Axe. BP and Axe. Am I allowed to use the Sheriff's Badge? I mean, I don't. I, why, why would I? But also, I don't see why I couldn't. Wait, because the axe is a pistol, it's buffed by the sheriff's badge? Oh, fuck. I don't even care. You guys. Huh. That worked. Play Waddle Gobbler. <laughs> Difficult. Ah, uh, fucking. I wouldn't know the meaning of the word. I don't know what it is. I'm just good at Borderlands. Fuck it. I'll go right now. You gotta get into the kitchen, kill everybody, and poison the gobbler's food. Once the poison takes effect, you can kill him. Ah, fuck that, Torg. No offense. I'm gonna just win. I'll just, I'll kill him. We're off to a good start. I'll beat it. I'm gonna beat this whole ass DLC. Oh, wait, guys. Do I need a death counter? Yeah, cool. Looks good to me. Oh, I have a skill point. Now I'm gonna absolutely destroy them. Oh no, I'm silly. There's such an obvious choice of what to get. How could I be so naive? There we go. Now I have pulled the pin. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know that was there. I don't think I'm getting past this fucking chef. Okay, Ramsey's a little strong. Maybe I'll get the pull the pin. I didn't get the pull the pin. Guys, I'm sorry to say, I think I'm gonna have to come back to this later. As, as much as I'd enjoy this, I am not getting very far. I'm a genius. Man, I, I had so much respect for these bandits until they started shooting me. I don't know how to cheese him without guns, so I'm just gonna chuck grenades at him and hope for the best. Come on, bitch. Give me pull the pin. What are the odds that kills Flint? <laughs> oh my god, it actually did! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, this shit again. Yeah, he's broken. 
the mod is enemies only, I couldn't imagine four McQuagles. I don't know how to respond to that one. Oi, get out of here. Oh god, what have I done? Get it away from me. I'm fine. I'm absolutely fine. Not even worried. <laughs> it was the fucking pebble. The pebble got me. Alright, well now that these guys are all distracted with each other, I'm just gonna slip in undetected. They'll never know I'm here. They'll never notice. I'm a master of stealth. I think they noticed I was here. Alright, lucky number 13. No more deaths for the entire run. This is gonna be a long run? Nah. It's gonna be easy. Short and easy. Like me. Oh, wait. Okay, quick question. Do car guns count as guns? Yes? Alright, well, Quirky said it. All it takes is one Quirky for me to be swayed. Oh, that's a lot of yeses. Alright, car guns are guns. No using them. The dust is gonna be interesting. Oi! Oi! Alright, what gun should I get uh, an SDU for? Snipers? Grenades? Why? What? If you... No, I'm, I don't know about grenade SDU. Normally I'd go grenade SDU, but I'll go bank. I'll go bank SDU. Come on, don't run away. Don't run away. Thank you. Oh fuck you. I've got a spot for you in my liver. I'm taking you. How far am I trying to take this run? OP10. You believe in me because when I fail you feel better about yourself? Well that's weirdly mean. Alright, Lilith. Have fun killing things for me. Oh hello. Goodbye. This is just isn't even that many psychos. What am I supposed to be scared of here? Don't down me. Ah, oh, you downed me, you cunt. Oh, I leveled up and I'm back up. Nice. Hold on, did- wait, did Lilith just technically revive me? Can we be sure that McQuaggle has bones without proof? I never claimed to have bones. I claimed that the x-ray was not needed. Secretly a squid? Xander. I told you that in confidence. You can't... Go, you know what? No one's gonna believe you anyway, so never mind. Fuck you. You can't just go outing my secrets. They're not gonna fucking believe you. McQuaggle is octo-dead. Nah, I'm not a fucking octopus. Don't... don't fight me. I have ten tentacles because I'm a squid. No, you're being racist right now, guys. You're being very racist. Alright, time to get the best shield in the game. I fucking hate this mission, though. Just the shield is so good. Krieg, Krieg seems like a cop-out? No, Axton would be a cop-out. Krieg is the harder, but still possible choice. Axton can throw grenades and fight for your life. How is Krieg a cop-out? I can just walk up to them and skyrocket, maybe? Oh! That's... That's not good! Give grenade. Oh, never mind. That's fine. I'm chilling. Whoa, there's four scorches. How did I not expect that? Mike decided to go nude while he plays Borderlands 2. Again, Xander. I tell you these things in confidence, in secret, supposed to be between me and you, but no. You gotta go air it out to everybody, don't you? Fucking hell. Last time I tell you any secrets. I swear to God. Why must you be nice to the mean man? He usually bullies me. He's made me cry on multiple occasions. He told me I'm the reason my parents are divorced. They're not divorced, but it still hurt. Oh god, this man gave me a gun? Baloney. Fuck you. I'm glad I get to kill you next. Or it could be like a cookout or something. Just keep an open mind about it, you know? Could be a cookout. I, you know what? I guess she's not wrong. I think it would have been a cookout. Oh, four Claytons, that's right. What? Yeah. 
Easy. I don't even know what you guys were worried about. Also, huh? Patron shoutouts. Very thanks of the special variety to Chody, who hates time travel movies so much he created a time machine to stop the Back to the Future movies from being made. Then they made a movie about it. Extra special thanks to Shedder Dude, who is one of a kind. Even in the infinite multiverse, you'll never find anyone like him. And he made sure of that. U.S. Navy Squid, who finally achieved his dream of opening a store that sells denial. That sounds fake, but I don't have enough money to not believe him. Special thanks to Tarkus Lives, who has been to space even though he's not an astronaut. He keeps sneaking in by Fligmode, who is the fastest man alive if you don't count the people that are faster. The infamous Potato, who is the exception that proves the rule. All of them. All of the rules. Anytime someone says that, they're talking about him. Dwarvo, who will never reveal his secret. How did he eat 80 hot dogs in less than 10 minutes? The world may never know. McBaconator, who has devoted his life to being a bike surgeon. He even donated his own kidney to a bike once. The owner wasn't thrilled about that one. Abaddon, who is a certified bread inspector. You better make sure your bread is up to par or you will go to prison. Professor Sequoia, who once told a joke so funny that everyone died laughing. Literally, he's in prison now. Wabaki, who was once on trial for being too friendly. He's just so nice they couldn't handle it. Also, we robbed a bank, but it was mostly the nice thing. Theo Watson, who studied magic for 300 years only to find out that magic isn't real. Rhododendron, who created Facebook. It wasn't that Zucky guy, it was him all along. And Warlord, who has the power to always miss. It doesn't matter what he's aiming at, he will miss. 